Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. So in today's video, we are going to be talking about Lewandowski and that is going to be the only player that we are going to be focusing on because we need to know exactly what is going on with Lewandowski, what is the position of all parties when it comes to Barcelona, the agent of Lewandowski, and also what is Xavi Hernandez trying to do? What is his current moves in order to get Lewandowski into this club? And so now that we do have Barcelona's season all wrapped up, you better bet that there's going to be a lot of movements going on within this Barcelona football club but before we go into any of this i do want to speak about the one football app if you guys do want to find out what's currently going on with your favorite player your favorite team what's currently going on within the league or any transfer that you do want to follow like for example the Lewandowski case the one football app is going to be there to inform you immediately and live this is basically where i do get all of my information and how i build my videos on youtube and so if you guys do want to download the one football app you can so by scanning the qr code that you do see here on the screen and there's also going to be a link that will be provided down below on the pinned comment and on the description box. It'll take you straight to the app store. You can download the OneFootball app and then set exactly who you do want to follow and then you'll be set and done from there. But now, let's get back into the video and let's talk about Lewandowski, right? Because look, a couple of hours ago, Bayern Munich did put out a statement when it comes to defending Lewandowski and him staying at that club. And this is what they said and I quote, on the current situation with Lewandowski, Bayern has repeatedly commented. The club has also spoken repeatedly about whether Bayern have made an offer to Lewandowski and his management. He is one of the best footballers in Bayern's history. The board members have repeatedly publicly expressed how much Bayern values Robert Lewandowski and how important he is to FC Bayern. Bayern will not comment on descriptions of confidential meetings or allegations of confidential talks. And so the reason why Bayern Munich do seem like they're emphasizing so much on how grateful they are to someone like Lewandowski, it is because the agent of Lewandowski did say something yesterday before the match between Barcelona and Villarreal and this is what the agent of Lewandowski had to say and I quote for Lewandowski Bayern Munich is history Lewandowski has the chance to move to the club he has always dreamt of why is Bayern Munich denying him this opportunity Lewandowski wants to leave this summer none of us care about the money the truth is that he hasn't felt respected by the board since a few months now Bayern lost Lewandowski not only as a footballer but also also as a person and then he continues to say Lewandowski is a smart man and he knows what was going on around him and what Bayern was planning he knew the club wanted to replace him for Erling Haaland and so look this is a huge hit going at Bayern Munich like it does seem like Lewandowski was not happy on knowing that Bayern were planning to replace this player going on to the next season because look, Bayern's whole idea was to renew Lewandowski, but at the same time, he also knew that they wanted to bring Erling Haaland in to replace Lewandowski, and Lewandowski did not like that. He did not like that feeling of, okay, if your intentions were to always drop me and to reduce my minutes next season by trying to get Erling Haaland, what am I even doing here? Because I even scored 40 to 50 goals. Why would I be dropped and have my minutes reduced next season only because you want to bring in someone like Erling Haaland? Do you not value me? Do you not think that I am still good enough to bring the results at Bayern Munich? And so that is the way Lewandowski did see things. Now, of course, Erling Haaland went to a team which is Manchester City, so that is all said and done. But the fact that Lewandowski knew that he was going to get replaced next season, he did not like that. And what makes things even worse is that Bayern Munich are not even doing Lewandowski the favor of releasing this player, even though he knows, right? And we do know that he has given a lot to Bayern Munich. All of these goals, all of these titles, which is very true. Lewandowski, at the age of 33, 34 years old, he does have to write to decide where he does want to go and Lewandowski is very keen on making that new adventure he wants to go somewhere else he wants to go outside from Germany and that is FC Barcelona because he believes that at FC Barcelona he can be valued where there's going to be a lot of focus on a number nine and that is Lewandowski and the reason why Lewandowski does seem so committed to a team like FC Barcelona and why he thinks that that will be the perfect fit and why he believes he's also going to be valued it is because Xavi Hernandez has spoken with this player and it does say here according to Sky Sports Xavi has actually spoken to Lewandowski twice, not once. The Barcelona coach has explained to him about his plans and project and how he wants Lewandowski to be the main and most focused number nine for his team. So it's amazing, right, to see that Xavi Hernandez has been given the responsibility to talk to certain players. Like usually we see the sporting director try to convince a certain player to come to this club. Like for example, the person that's supposed to be doing this job, it is Jordi Cruyff. And we have also been seeing this before Laporta did even take over. It was 
always the sporting director that was in charge to basically speak to these players to come to this club. But what we are seeing here, coming from John Laporta's Barcelona, is that this club does believe that Xavi Hernandez does have enough polling power for these players because of who he is, right? His image and what he was for football. And they want to use Xavi Hernandez's power to seduce these players to arrive at this club as long as they are interested. Now look, right, like what I'm going to be saying here, it is going to be speculation. This is not true at all. This is just something that I have been thinking about lately and something that has been on the back of my head. But I really do hope that what we are seeing here is not the same thing like how we saw Kylian Pape treat Real Madrid. Like he was using basically Real Madrid in a way to get a bigger contract from PSG. Like I hope that Lewandowski does not use FC Barcelona just to get a bigger contract coming from Bayern Munich. Now again, this is just speculation. Maybe this m might not even be true. Maybe the real reason why Lewandowski is using Barcelona is because he actually wants to go to Barcelona. Again, I do want to make that very clear. It is just speculation, something that I have been thinking about because I do see some similarities between Kylian Pape being destined, supposedly, right, what he used to, being destined to go to Real Madrid, but ended up staying at PSG. I hope that we do not see the same thing with Lewandowski and him supposedly being destined to join Barcelona, but in the end gets a bigger contract at Bayern Munich and continues to stay there for the next four to five years. But in the end, I do believe that Lewandowski wants to move away. He wants to come to Barcelona. And if you guys are wondering, what is Barcelona's current offer to Bayern Munich? Because we do know that there is personal terms already agreed between Barcelona and Lewandowski, which everything is okay. But the offer between Barcelona and Bayern Munich is going to be this. And it does say here, according to Sky Sport, Barcelona's 32 million euro offer to Lewandowski also includes an additional 5 million euro bonus, which in total is going to amount to 37 million euros. Bayern are yet to give back a formal response. So if you guys are wondering what does bonuses mean, it basically means that if, let's say for example, Lewandowski makes 25 or 45 appearances with Barcelona, that bonus is going to be triggered or it could be goal based. If Lewandowski scores like 30 plus goals for Barcelona, that could possibly mean that Barcelona are going to be paying the full 5 million euros to Bayern Munich. It could mean a variety of things, but I do think that in the end, the 37 million euro total deal is going to be guaranteed because of how heavily he's going to be used because we know he's going to be scoring a lot of goals for Barcelona, maybe even 40 plus, and also he's going to be bringing in the assist. And so here's going to be the final conclusion for this video. I hope that this saga does not end up being so dragged out all the way until like August 31st. We know that Bayern Munich is a team that's very hard to negotiate with. I have always said that Bayern Munich are not stupid. Bayern Munich always want to get the best from every deal, but the idea coming from Xavi's Barcelona is very clear. We know exactly what Xavi wants next season. He wants to see a front three of Ansu, Lewandowski, and Dembele. And if Dembele does not renew for whatever reason, we could see Ansu Fati, Lewandowski, and Rafinha. And if we do not see Dembele renew, and we do not see Lewandowski come to Barcelona, then the next place that we should go to is church, right? Let's go find God, let's go pray, <laughs> and just hope for the best, right? But that is basically going to be the latest updates regarding Lewandowski. Of course, if anything brand new does come up when it comes to this player and his operation to Barcelona, we are going to be talking about it here in this YouTube channel. So if you guys did enjoy this video, please give it a like, subscribe to the channel. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys are new here, welcome to this channel. Welcome to the family, and I will see you guys in the next video.